Hello everyone, as promised here goes the tutorial on the installation of add-ons and mods. Don't worry, it's very easy if you follow the steps shown in this video. First thing needed is for you to download the add-ons files of the mods you're wanting to play with. You can find them on the Driver Syndicate website or in the Driver Discord specific channels. For this video, I've listed every mod I'm installing in the description of this video. When you have all the files, simply put them all in the add-ons folders of the Syndicate directory and start to extract them all. Some will not work with WinRAR, so you can use 7-zip for example. Cities don't need extra steps for their installation, but now you need to do a little more to install the cars. Each new car files have to be placed in the community car folder, but they also have dependencies to work correctly and that means you need to install the wheels and the engine sounds. The wheels are in all guard vehicles folder and need to be put in community's car as well. Engine sound add-ons has its own tutorial video that you can check but it's just about placing the files in the right folders. For all guard vehicles pack, you need to go in multiple folders till you find the community car that you can copy paste in your add-ons folders and it will just add the files for the folder. Missions and game modes don't require specific steps. When everything is placed in the folder, you can launch the game and go in the add-on sub-menu in the in-game menu and a lot of mods should appear. You can now enable them by selecting on instead of off. Be aware that some mods can conflict with each other, so I don't advise to enable everything at the same time. For example, if you enable Havana, you will not be able to play Silver Cat's missions and the police sounds will be in Spanish on every map. Simply disable it where you're not playing it. Silver Cat's requires default Nikki enabled to work because some of the location of the mission are in specific part of that city. If default Nikki isn't enabled, the game will just restart when you try to start the mission using the console command start silver slash silver1. If you forgot to install a required add-ons or did it wrong, the game may crash. In that case, go in the logs folder and look at the files to see what went wrong. You can also post it on the driver discord so the community can help you with the installation. I hope this video will be helpful and if you have any question, feel free to ask it in the comments. See you!